what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome and we're back with some more joe joe bizarre adventure once again people we are here with another two episodes three and four hopefully this is aired on the next day after one and two so you guys can enjoy jojo's for this entire week i am trying to do things different on the channel um going forward of course you guys might have been seeing it already in the channel who knows okay so um as soon as i get done with doing at least 10 of these episodes you guys will see it on the channel i won't do it before i have that done because i want you guys to have at least have a week of whatever series that we're watching as soon as they're premiered on the channel okay so if we gotta wait an extra week for you to see 10 more episodes i think that's good but anyways i'll give you back to back to back episodes every day two episodes a day that's what i want to do but anyways let's jump in so at last two episodes of the stardust crusaders arc here i'm imagining that we met um the new jojo that's gonna continue the legacy okay the new john i remember his name i keep calling him joe to see <laughs> I keep calling him Jodeci, okay? Um, but anyways, very, very um, serious Jojo off the bat. He's not so funny. He's not like, he's definitely not like Joseph at all. He's like super serious and, you know what I'm saying? Kind of a jerk. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, Jojo was more of like, I mean, Joseph was more, you know, He's a character. He's, you know what I'm saying? He's a teenager. He's funny. The jokes, sometimes they land, sometimes they don't, but they're still funny when they don't, when they don't. It's just really cheesy stuff that he does sometimes that you're like, why? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, but with this character now, you know, this new Jojo, not funny at all. Like he's just super serious about everything that he does. And now we got introduced to these stands. So it's like these spirits that, you know, it seems like anybody can have these spirits. They just have to tap into that power. It seems, I don't know yet. We haven't had em enough information about the stands to understand it, but it seems like J Joseph does have a stand, which is weird. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Cause he has to, it's like he can, seems like he can, um, photograph the future maybe. I think that's what he described. I was trying to catch it. I did not. So I'm guessing it's not the only time he's going to use that power. So I'm looking forward to see what he's when he uses it again to see exactly what it does. It seems like he can f actually photograph his actual memories or something of the sort. You get what I'm saying? Or his dreams or something. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it's 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 a weird power. Um, but anyways, um, I don't know if they're straying away from the whole Hamon situation or if that's included in the whole stand situation, but I guess we'll see that later. Okay. So yeah, let's jump in and I will catch you guys for the review. All right, so that was two more episodes of the wonderful JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Um, only with JoJo I can have so many different kind of like reactions to it stuff. Cause it's like this anime just brings out so many different emotions out of you. Like without, without you even realizing what's happening. Like it's a super funny anime. But it's also a very serious anime. It, as I've said before in the past about this anime, it's one of the weirdest things I've ever seen. Where it's one of the weirdest animes. Like you'll see some of the weirdest stuff happen. You get what I'm saying? That you wouldn't necessarily see in other animes. You get what I'm saying? So, um, you know, like the move bitch line. Like you're not gonna really see that. <laughs> You're not gonna really see that in anime very often if you even see it at all so it was just it was just funny um because it just it just reminded me of the ludicrous song um move bitch get out the way <laughs> like i really that's what i 
um, flashed in my head. That's why I was dying to laugh to because I was like, damn, he really told this bitch to move out of his way. <laughs> it was hilarious. But anyways, let's talk about what's going on. So basically, they were on the way to Egypt to go, you know, take care of because Holly is holy, holly, holly, <laughs> holly is sick because her stand is manifested and it's making her sick um, because she doesn't have the strength to like learn to control it because she's not a fighter <clears throat> she's not a father fighter like um jotaro and you know all of them right so she you know failed to you know she can't keep up because really and truly the reason why they're why she's being affected is because of Dio taking Jonathan's body so he's kind of he's kind of like a parasite on the bloodline you know of Joe stars he's like a parasite right now like you know what I'm saying like he's interrupting the flow the blood the flow of the bloodline you know what I'm saying so I like that concept that they're going with you know story wise you know in certain in certain ways Jojo's can be all over the place sometimes you know, but it's still a very comprehensive story to follow. This is by no means the greatest story ever in anime history. You know what I'm saying? I've said this a lot of times about, about Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. This is just a fun, it's a fun ride, but there is a story to it that I enjoy. It's kind of like, it's kind of like watching a video game. That's how I take Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. It's kind of like you're watching a video game and every part, you know, coming from, you know, you know episode one till now it's kind of like um after jonathan died i think it was in episode nine when jonathan died and then we moved on to joseph you know what i'm saying like it's kind of like you're you're at it's like different games you're playing like the first episodes one through nine was like the first you know video game with all hype then the, then the, then the um the jonathan uh, no the joseph video game came out and it was like oh this shit is tight too you know what i'm saying um and it's kind of like the story is kind of like following a video game story and that's how it, it feels to me that's how i feel when i watch it it's like i'm watching somebody play a video game because it's that kind of aesthetic you know what i'm saying there is a story there it's not a deep deep story but you do want to know more behind this lore like is the mask ever going to come back into play because of what happened with um joseph's storyline you know what i mean like is there something else going to happen that we can really really see where the story can can end up or where where it's gonna go because you don't know what you're in for like as i said you know this one picks up the introduction of stands just come out of nowhere there was no indication of this ever in the past episodes so this being introduced in episode one of stardust crusaders you know what i'm saying and you're still you're more following the bloodline of joe star more than anything else in this story like every anything you know what i'm saying that you see that's different you know, you can just expect something different for the next chapter. Like, I think the next one we're watching is Diamond is Unbreakable, I think it is. I, I think that's the name of it because I did try to, to get it. I did try to get it. I, I looked it up because I know what order I'm supposed to watch it. So I know which one, even though and even you guys have sent it, um, sent the order of how I'm supposed to watch the parts. Um, so I know, I think the next one after Stardust Crusaders is Diamond is Unbreakable, if I'm not mistaken. So who's to know what the hell they're going to introduce in, in that next part? I don't even know. All I know is they just introduced stands into the story. And as I said, I look at this as a, it's like a video game story. So every chapter you're going to see things that are going to be new. I mean, they, you know what I'm saying? Like every chapter is, is going to be new. I think there's going to be something in Diamond is Unbreakable that's going to be like, okay, I guess somebody, because by the end of this, you know what I'm saying, um, jo Jotaro is probably going to be old and his grandson is probably going to take over in Diamond is Unbreakable because that's pretty much what has been going on. It's kind of like grandson 
um, you had Jonathan Dostar and then you had Joseph which was the grandson and then now we have Joseph's grandson in this part so I'm guessing in Diamond is Unbreakable you're gonna have Jotaro's grandson taking over the mantle of the um, to continue the Jonathan Jonathan's bloodline or even you know his father I think his, fa his father's name was was Joe right or I don't remember his father's name but I think his or, or was he Jonathan senior I think he was Jonathan senior but he could have been Joe Joe star <laughs> I don't know but you know uh, but Jojo nonetheless but so I'm appreciating this I see um, you know what I'm saying I want to see what's what's happening in this story because it's very interesting Dio is always hiding and sending niggas to go fight his battles that's the kind of villain he is you know what I'm saying he sends out all the peep squeak niggas to go get beat up or whatever and then we have a final showdown with him he's not like the others like we had you know that went up against Joseph that was like pretty upfront they're like nigga we the shit we've been around for hundreds of thousands of years my dude <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So we that we that do. You know what I'm saying? We don't need niggas to fight our battles. We fight them ourselves and get bodied just the same. <laughs> so, anyways, thank you guys so much for tuning in. That is all I have to say on this topic, man. I appreciate y'all for tuning in as always, man. I'm loving this so far. Four episodes in. I have a lot more to go. I have about six more episodes to go. And then we can dive back in when well i can dive back in but at least you guys will have 10 episodes to watch throughout the week whenever this drops on a monday or whatever so hopefully i can get that out to you guys you guys will be able to enjoy it um thank you guys so much don't forget to like the video guys you guys be watching my shit and not liking my videos man like seriously like on a serious note guys you guys need to like the video if if it's a hundred a hundred of y'all watching these episodes i need at least 40 50 of y'all liking it man like i know you guys are enjoying the videos i know you guys just want to enjoy the content i'm providing full reactions over here the least y'all can do is leave a like on the channel and hit that notification bell so you know when this stuff is coming out all right i'm grinding out here um i know that at this moment y'all probably watching stuff on the channel that you know i binge watch through to, to make sure y'all have stuff to watch on the channel all the time is what i'm gearing towards to become a full-time content creator hopefully i can get there get to the point where i'm seeing enough yield from doing this so i can say okay i can forget about pretty much everything else and let it just run itself um the other stuff that i have going on and just concentrate on just providing content 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 and also do more streams and stuff like that i'm planning to do a lot more gaming you know live stream gaming um in the future as soon as these consoles decide to drop with all this hold up that they have and won't announce won't announce price and this game of chicken that they're playing with the consoles we already know that when it's announced that the ps5 is going to be the shit <laughs> what's the hold up just let it fly sony just let it fly man you know the thing is going to sell out you know it's going to sell out the series x is going to still be on the shelf but you know what i'm saying it's high you won the battle there is no contest anymore let us know what the price is sony let us know what the price is man i appreciate y'all i appreciate y'all anyways let me get my hands on that and we see what I get done. Leave a like, leave a comment, it's your boy Terabyte Reacts, and I'm out. Peace.